My name is Colton Funk, and I'm the Associate Director for Sports Medicine here at St. Louis. So within sports medicine, we take care of all the emergency care on the field. So a student athlete goes down, we run out there and take care of them right away. And on the backside, if they are injured, we do all the rehabilitation process. So um, getting a kid from post-surgical back to playing the sport that they love. How can we take a, an athlete that's been practicing every day of the week, playing games, how can we keep them operating at a, a high level? Whether that's, you know, coming in, doing specific things with us or giving them, you know, movements or rehab exercises to do before they get hurt to prevent that injury from, you know, actually happening. Our girls sometimes see Tyler two or three times a day. So when we have 5 a.m. practices, he's there at 4.15. So the majority of our kids will go in there before practice. Sometimes they have rehabs that they're doing after practice or they're using ice baths or using ice. I don't think anybody works more hours than our athletic training staff. They're here before we get to work and they're here later. They probably over the course of the time spend way more time with our student athletes than we do. Since Tyler and I've been here, our goal has been to be the best program in the conference. We want to strive to, to set ourselves apart and have everybody else playing catch up to us. So we use data to collect information to make better decision making with rehabs, with um, inventory supplies. Um, we're always buying state of the art equipment to try and get it to the next level so that our student athletes can recover faster. For our helmets, we have a technology that measures every impact that our players take to their helmet. Colton has that monitor on his belt so it vibrates if if we need to check someone out based on an impact that they took. Being injured the first thought that runs through your head is like oh my season's over but Colton's been there through it all even the other trainers just being there and motivating me um, it's hard staying motivated when you're injured. They're super personable like they crack jokes they make it fun to be in there so like being injured is not like a horrible time as it would normally be. When we won the national championship we wanted Tyler to be there celebrating with us. Like we wanted him to take pictures with the trophy. He's been like a key part of like all we do. I think it's important to support sports medicine because we deal with every team. There's no one that impacts all 26 sports like athletic performance and the sports medicine staff. They see all 26 sports, 700 plus student athletes. The support that we get goes into bettering our program, bettering our care for our student athletes and helping that those results on the field or court or, or whatever playing surface we have. I think people should support athletics because of the impact that we have on student athletes every single day. I think when you look at this building and the people in this building, whether it's coaching staff, administration, student athletes, uh, the impact that we have on their lives and the impact that they are gonna go and have into this world after their four years at St. Olaf is something that you can't measure.